In this demo, we're going to take a look at Finale Inventory. Madison is in charge of their partner program out there, and she's going to show us Finale. You're going to get a demo of Finale in this video. Now, Finale has been around since 2009. I actually didn't start in this industry until 2006. So Finale has been around about almost as long as I have. and. Yeah, and Finale is robust e-commerce software. High volume fulfillment, so it's definitely fulfillment software. And they have 50 internal uh, integrations with marketplaces and big retailers and shopping carts and whatnot. But also they have a special integration with ShipStation, which opens them up to the world of other integrations. Everything that ShipStation integrates with, they integrate with because of the way they've designed their software to work with ShipStation. A little bit else you should know about Finale is you know, their customers range from about a million a year to a hundred million a year. So if you're doing somewhere between a million a year and a hundred million a year, Finale would be the consideration if you're a QuickBooks user as well, of course. And also, they are vanilla with their, in, they can help a lot of different industries. They have a few focuses that they really shine in, one of which is uh, oils and supplements. And even though they're e-commerce, they actually do a little bit of, of manufacturing or assembly. So here's Madison. Madison, tell us a little bit about your yourself. Hi, everybody. So I'm Madison. I am Partner Program Manager here at Finale. I've been here almost two years now. It started out as um, a CRM here at Finale. And, um, you know, I, I didn't have much of an inventory background until I came to Finale. And it's been, you know, real eye opening, I guess. You know, everybody, everybody has inventory and, you know, it, it needs managed. So I, it's been, you know, great to see kind of, you know, the kind of customers we run into and just just helping people, helping people streamline their processes, make, you know, running their business more efficiently. Just it's everything. a fun world to be in. That's for sure. It's exciting. It <laughs> yeah, we're Never stops changing. We're in this industry because I guess I have a soft spot in my heart for small companies and small business owners. I've often seen mm -hmm. Um, the vulnerability and, and the and the fear. A lot of the people I work with, this is the first time they've uh, made an inventory software purchasing decision, right? And yes. Yes. so here at Brando Consulting, we uh, empower you. We we take away that vulnerability and and that fear. And we, we help you make the right inventory software purchase. Make sure you're put in touch with the right people to help you set it up properly and, and teach you how to use it. So Finale is one of our partners. Love working with them. And, and uh, we're excited to see a quick um, overview demo of Finale. We have another deep dive demo if you'd like to look at it further or if you'd like a, a live demo of Finale, definitely click on the link below to schedule a live a demo. And if you're unsure, if you'd like a, a third party, non-biased opinion, uh, reach out to us here at Brando Consulting. We, we can help you assess Finale. We do a deep dive discovery interview with your business and, and help you find the right software. But let's check out Finale. Let's take a look. Show us, uh, All right. show us, um, we're going to look at the sales order screen, the work order screen, the purchase order screen, and then receiving and work order fulfillment or build fulfillment and sales order fulfillment. So show us all the marketplaces that you integrate with. Show us um, right. where you capture sales from, because this is automated, right? We okay. want to automate the, yes. the creation of these yes. sales orders. Yes. So this is, um, you know, real quickly, this is your home screen, but I am going to jump to my other tab here. So these are all the platforms Finale natively integrates with. So, um, you know, most of these platforms, I would say, um, you know, 90% of them are plug and play. You can easily, you know, enter in a couple, you know, credentials and click the connect button and you are connected. You, you know, your software is connected to Finale. There's no need for a developer. Or anything like that to integrate with these they're um plug and play that's awesome you know, we have everything from ebay etsy fair you know some kind of um, more obscure ones like new wig and presta shop 
of course, QuickBooks Online. Um, we also integrate, um, you know, like you said, with ShipStation is our, um, you know, our one of our best um, shipping platforms, as well as, you know, ShipRush, ShipRush, pardon me, Shipping Easy. And we do integrate with some point of sales as well. So that would be Square, Vend, Lightspeed. And um, we also have um, SPS Commerce, which, in, which supports um, EDI orders. So Finale does integrate with SPS as well. This is a good way yes. to increase sales and automate, you know, leverage the, the capturing of all these sales. Uh, Finale can do upwards of around a million orders a month. Uh, if you're just pushing through tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands of, of orders per week or per month, Finale's, Finale can handle it. And, you know, we do sit, um, this is kind of where Finale sits. So we do sit a little downstream. Your orders come in, you know, you're placed in your marketplace. So Walmart, Big Commerce, Shopify, Amazon, any of those, they come down to ShipStation and they come down to Finale. So Finale's integration with ShipStation runs every five minutes. We pull in orders from ShipStation every five minutes. And one great thing about Finale and ShipStation is that Finale makes ShipStation refresh their stores as well. So they're refreshing their connections with their marketplaces more often because of Finale too. So we are getting, you know, um, the most accurate data as fast as we can. But we then, you know, sync down to QuickBooks and then Finale also syncs information, you know, back up to the marketplace. So we sync your updated stock levels back to those marketplaces within five minutes as well. So when you place your order in, you know, for example, Walmart, it comes into ShipStation and then it will come into Finale. And when you pick and pack the order on the scanner in Finale, you um, Finale will sync that option. You know, we'll sync that the order is picked and packed to our cloud. And then when you ship it in ShipStation, Finale will automatically mark that order shipped and complete in our system. There's no need to come into Finale and, you know, ship orders manually or anything like that. You shipping them in ShipStation, we'll ship them in Finale, mark them complete. So it's kind of like an off-hands process there. And Finale handles bundles kits and and uh Angels and kits. yeah but why don't you show us that yes, why don't you take us to uh, uh yes, a bundle yes so here is our bill of materials down here and like you said so we do have a couple different options to handle this bill of materials we do have more of an, an assembly type setting so where you are putting these items together for an order i guess maybe do you want to explain that a little bit better <laughs> Yeah, yeah, so uh, this is a neat feature. You can either automate the the bundling in the picking workflow as it's as it's picked, packed, and go out the door, or um, you can assemble in advance in anticipation of a sale. You know, so you could bundle these together and then put the finished bundle in stock, so you can see how many finished bundles you have in stock, or you can set the bill of material to just be something that automates in the picking process and bundles as it goes out the door um that makes yeah, sense makes perfect perfect sense so yep finale has both of those options and we're also able you know to always tell you how many you could potentially build so given your component quantities finale at any given time will always be able to tell you how many you could build based on that uh, let's take a look at the purchasing screen yes i think it's i think it's awesome what you guys do to help people decide what to buy and then automate the creation of the purchase order i think a lot of these small small business owners don't realize that some of these inventory management software programs these ims programs can do that you know help them decide what to buy it's it's such a powerful thing i've talked to so many people that uh, they have a purchasing agent that spends 40 hours a week deciding what to buy and manually making purchasing decisions when if you've got accurate inventory and you've got all your orders in there that 40 hours can turn to four hours you know yeah so like you said finale has a um a reordering screen so based on the end of the data you enter in the product information in Finale, you know, you can use the sales velocity reordering. So, you know, based on how many sales you've had in the past, um, you know, year or six months, whatever time period you suggest. And Finale will be able to tell you how many, you know, you need to reorder based on how many you're selling and based on how long it takes for your, your stock to get to us from your supplier. So Finale is able to take in your different lead times and determine your reorder points based on that. 
And then, like you said, you don't have to kind of search for everything that needs to be reordered. You'll go, you'll come up here to this purchasing screen, your reordering tab here, and you um, you can see all the SKUs that need to be reordered in the screen. You can filter it by location, by supplier, and create the POs, you know, right here in bulk or one by one. And when you click on this button to create the purchase order, that doesn't automatically email your vendor. You're not losing control over anything. That's just going to create the purchase order for you. And then you can still go to the purchase order and edit it and finagle it and do whatever you need mm -hmm. before you email it to the vendor. So, so you have control. This is just yes. um, really automating and empowering you to optimize your purchasing process exactly exactly and when you are ready to send that purchase order off to your vendor you know finale does generate you a purchase order document that is completely customizable we can customize the color scheme to fit your scheme of course add your logo adjust the columns add in the you know terms and conditions anything like that so you are able to print this po directly from finale and email it directly to your vendor from finale as well Okay. So no need to kind of leave the system. So we asked the vendor, the vendor shipped the goods to us. What do we do to assure that our, our inventory is going to be accurate when we receive it? You've got a mobile warehouse scanner, which I think is so important to create accurate inventory because in order for your inventory to be accurate, I think a good principle to adopt is to to assign the people or to tell tell your people that the person that is touching the inventory should be the person that records the inventory. And here's the catcher, here's the clincher in real time. Right? If if you are doing that, if if the person that touches the inventory records what he or she did in real time, your inventory is going to be accurate. None of this Oh, let's place the packing list uh, in the office and let someone in the office record the packing list two, three hours later, or even worse, two to three days later. Your inventory is never going to be accurate. But with this tool right here, Madison, show us the in real time receiving um, feature you have. Yes. So um, you come down here and you sync the scanner. It syncs up, you know, it syncs to the cloud, checks anything you did in the cloud and the UI, syncs it to the scanner. Everything is, you know, fully synced and connected. You come down here to receive. You tell Finale which order you're receiving. I'm receiving my order 253. You tell Finale where you want it to go. I want it to go into my main. You tell Finale, um, you scan the barcodes. So you scan the items you're going to receive. So if you scan a product that's not on this order, Finale is going to throw up an X. You know, if I try to scan, you know, um, let me see, skew D100. Finale is not going to let me enter this because, oh, okay, it did. I lied. Usually it doesn't let you. So you can receive more or less what you scan. than, than okay. what you ordered, which is really important because what the guys need to be doing when receiving is they need to count and then record what they counted. Regardless of what the PO says, just record what they okay. counted and then your, your inventory is going to be accurate. So this is a powerful tool, um, the receiving tool. So let's, uh, let's take a look at fulfilling the sales order now, All right? So we, we received it and yeah, we're going to, we're going to skip over the work order and the bundles. I think we spent enough time on that. Yeah. Show us picking this. This is robust. Yes. Finale has really yes. robust picking. So it's coming on the door and they even have sort of a triage step to help fulfill back orders as well. If it comes in and it's a back order, you can just pick it right away and ship it right back out the door to reduce the number of touches and reduce the number of steps, right? We want efficiency right. when we have high right. volume order fulfillment. So here we go. Show us, uh, show us the different picking features here. Yes, we have basic pick, wave pick, pick and pack and order batches. Basic pick is if you know your onesie twosie, you're going to pick, you know, one order from the warehouse, you're not doing a whole, you know, a whole bunch of them. So we have the basic pick option, you know, lower volume type of option. We have wave pick. So the wave pick is, you know, um, more of, you know, if you're picking more orders than the kind of basic pick option, you, the wave pick option allows you to kind of go through the warehouse and scan the items that you are picking into specific slots on your cart. So, you know, maybe your cart has 10 different slots and you're picking little nuts and bolts, you know, from your warehouse. You can tell Finale, you know, you're picking this skew, it's going into slot one. 
I'm picking this SKU, it's going into slot two. That way, when you go back to your packing station, you'll know, you know exactly which slot is referring to which order and which item goes where. There's no kind of confusion there. You have a table full of you know, 400 bolts and you're like, where did these all go? But that um, kind of eliminates that option there. We also have pick and pack. So this is um, kind of like a two-step process. So this is where you go gather your um, orders through the warehouse, you pick all the orders, and then you take them to a packing station where you then you know pack up the items and then um, ship them out that way. So we have that option as well. And we have order batches. So um, this is where if you are kind of maybe batching your orders up on maybe a common characteristic or um, location or something like that. So, you know, maybe um, you're batching them up by the picker. So um, you're able to kind of create order batches. You can either create them in Finale or in ShipStation. We communicate batches back and forth with ShipStation. So if you create your order batch in ShipStation, you're able to come into Finale on the scanner Scan your batch ID or type in your batch ID or choose your batch ID and um, pick by the batch as well. Awesome. So, awesome. And then once the pick that. is finished, it's ready to be shipped out of ShipStation. Shipped. You can now go into ShipStation and print out your shipping labels. And also Finale syncs with QuickBooks. When we received in um in finale it created a journal entry in quickbooks um, when we ship out of finale it creates um, a transaction that represents um what happened there you know if uh, for e-commerce usually it's just a what is it a sales receipt or a, or a sales order that that ties in with a payment because with e-commerce most things are prepaid right also finale does does landed cost um when when you when you enter the vendor's invoice uh on the purchasing screen the, you can upload landed cost and finale tracks the the average value that includes the average cost and also it can create a bill in quickbooks for a third-party vendor a third-party carrier shipping vendor so so i would say finale has robust accounting integration with quickbooks not light but i would say it's robust accounting integration so i think that's it i think uh i think we went through the whole flow yeah. if you would if you'd like to see a deeper dive we have another video that you could watch it's a lot longer than this if uh, you'd like to see a live demo definitely click on the link we'll get you in touch with with madison or or myself to to arrange it and yeah get you get you looking at finale if you feel like it might be a good fit uh, for your company please please don't hesitate to reach out if you have any questions or um you know questions or anything like that i'd be happy to help answer anything um you know this has been it's been great meeting with you lance and i'm glad we got to we got to do this together it was yeah it was great having you on our channel be sure to subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this feel free to Post your questions in the comments below as well and give this video a like if you felt like it was helpful and kind of started helping you with your with your shopping process. See ya. To see y'all soon.